And welcome back to Flexible Games, where we are playing Seven Days to Die. I had to actually think for a second. OBS just crashed, and I had to completely go out and restart the game. So that was fun. Uh, it says it's going to take 14 seconds, but I really don't believe that. Whoa! Whoa! Uh, I want to get some. I want to get some ammo crafted up here. Uh, now that we have a little bit of duct tape, and we have some components and miscellaneous stuff, uh, I think it's time uh, we have a little bit of pointage that we could put in here. Uh, my intellect is already maxed, so I don't really need to craft those. I must have gone into like level, yeah, level 80. So, hammer and forge, still can't, still can't craft that. That's unfortunate. Um, craft rockets, I don't really need to do that just yet. Shotgun turret, nail gun, I don't need to do that. Uh, I haven't been doing that, so I really don't have an engineering thing that I really need. So, that tells me I could, uh, I could either, oh, wow, I could have done, that could have triggered, like, just five minutes ago, and it would have been fine. All right. Still, have, still don't know how to get rid of that sound. Um, increase, could go that. Parkour is helpful once you get the boots. Cardio, that would be nice when I'm running around. Ninja movement. I really need to work on some other things, though. I would love that, since we're going to be doing a little mining. And I'm going to need three points for this. I need to get, I need to get my... Uh, I need to get my perception maxed here. That's going to take quite a few points. There is that. Let's turn... Uh, where's my rotten stuff? I have 75 bone. We need murky water. And I want to make glue. Uh, let's put the rest of this murky water away. Good times. I'm going to make uh, this cotton into cloth fabric. Cloth fragment. We. Ooh. Yeah, I'd forgotten I, I tweaked that recipe. So, yeah, we got lots of glue now. Um, so, duct tape. Duct tape. 42 duct tape. Go. Now, what happened to that sound? I'm, I'm missing... I'm missing the crafting sound. That's very strange. Like, very strange. Okay. Well, I'm not going to complain because it's annoying anyway. Okay, so we've got some duct tape now. We've got uh, a small amount of components. Let's see. Uh, rifle. I would love a marksman rifle. Uh, 50 mechanical parts. Wow. Okay. Um, we have just enough for that. I'm going to put that there. Obviously, we're going to need a bunch of springs. We're going to need some duct tape and some glue and some steel. And rifle. Oh, let's spell it right. Why can't I make this? Polymers. Oh, I forgot about the plastic. Not a cheap recipe. So, marksman rifle. Let's craft one of those guys up. Should be level six. Indeed. Level six. Put that right there. I want a quick axe. 
Actually, I don't have any iron. That takes iron and not steel. It's the diamond axe that takes takes that. Grab that back. Uh, so that's worth a little bit more. Craft a few of those and I'd be able to buy that helmet light. But I'm going to need a lot more forged iron. I am running low on ye old forged iron. And uh, also, you know, now that I think about it, let's grab a wrench. And we can use that to go around and grab some more parts. Because I've I have spotted quite a few different things around. Alright, we have a bit of gunpowder. Let's grab one of these. I crafted up some bullet tips in between episodes. So we our very first ammo, we are gonna be able to craft 940 of it. Bingo. Uh, does that change? Oh, no. I guess in single player, that doesn't change. But in multiplayer, that completely gets negated. Gets reset. Alright, so. We have now a, a supply of ammo, which is going to come in majorly handy. I don't really have any weapons mods that I can put on this at the moment. Hmm. I really need like some schematics. I just need so much stuff. Like, who would have thought that after I finished building this thing that I would have so much work left to do? Uh, let's see, crossbow repeater. I'd like to another one of these. And that's actually that's actually fairly good. So let's grab a little bit of steel. I already have the wood. Uh, crossbow. Wow, there's a lot of CR words in here. Crossbow repeater. Two glue, two leather, one duct tape. We can manage that. Two glue, one duct tape, two leather. Uh, I think I can craft this, yeah. There's a level six. Let's scrap this one. That gets us our our bolt back. All right, we're starting to we're starting to get loaded out here with some top tier stuff. Uh, I want to get some stuff now. Uh, let's see. Grab some more ammo. You know, one thing we don't have a whole lot of is feathers. Uh, ironically enough, feathers is where we're really falling short. Um, I like using crossbows when I go into a POI because it's, you know, it's a dead silent weapon. And making too much noise in a POI is not advised. Uh, okay, so we still have that treasure way up there, but let's see, coal and lead. I might need to go get some coal and lead. So let's make a day of it. You know, I need some iron as well. I just need all of the things, just all of the things. And now that we have... Oh yeah. Da, da, da. Where'd my there it is. Um Ooh. I can't I can't miss feathers. I'm I've been of I've been ignoring them for a while and now we're we're actually running short. Ooh. New marksman rifle. Oh man, they go flying. Wow. Okay. Little brass doesn't hurt. 
kind of want to save the rifle for for Horde Knight because I know we're going to be needing it. I need schematics as well. So one of my stops might have to be I need some iron. Get out of here. I might have to go to the shotgun Messiah. Yeah, this is gonna level me up a couple times. Alright, where's that bird? Ha ha ha! Ha ha ha! How do you like that, boys? There's some feathers. That gives me a lot more XP than I thought it would. Get out of your tree. Little mini little mini tree sitting here. I already looted that. Oh no. Uh making my way. To this mine. Oh look at all the iron. Told you iron is just everywhere. It's not. Oh, there's a traitor. Ooh, we might be able to go. Maybe he has something good. Ooh, I, I might want to drop by that traitor. Let's... Couple of these guys around. All right. All right. Yeah, we have lots. Of, we could sell him a lot of iron. Oh, no sell price, really. We can sell them stone, really? Stone? Uh, let's look at uh, resources. He has some duct tape. How about clothes? He has a mining helmet. If we sold our quick axe, we would be able to we would be able to do that. Um, how are we for barter? Can we get a few more of these? Yes, we can. So let's let's see what you have now. You know, in the last five seconds, I've really I've really improved myself. So I'm gonna I'm gonna sell you all of that because why not? Um. So yeah, he's got duct tape, but we we can we can make quite a bit of duct tape now. How about bone? Uh, resources. I'm not seeing any bone in there. He's got a mining helmet. That would be that would be very handy. Uh, can I craft? Oh, you want a guarantee, huh? Well, maybe you should try Shamway. <laughs> uh, football helmet. Does he have a football helmet? No, he doesn't. He does not have a football helmet. Because I don't think I have one either. So we're a little, a little worse for the wear here. Unfortunately. So I guess I, mean, I didn't bring anything to sell. Fortunately. Ooh, a twofer. All uh, right. And this, this was it. So, yeah, I see the lead.
Lead. All of the lead. And some coal. I hear a moaning. Guy way off in the distance. Really? Well, he's not dead yet. There he goes. Alright, where was I? Because I knew once I started digging that I would level up really, really fast. So I wanted, I wanted our base to be pretty well protected before I started this process. But this will give us good amounts of, uh, of resources for more ammo and all sorts of things. Kinda glad I, I scoped these these mines out beforehand. It's really gonna help. Ooh, lead? Yes. Beautiful. I'm just getting lots and lots and lots and lots of stuff for ammo. You know, in multiplayer games, you know, individually, you don't really have to do a whole lot of mining. Because, you know, if everybody's contributing, then, you know, everything combined is pretty good. But in single player, that's why I invented the quick axe. Because this thing does wonders when mining. Normally it would have taken days and days and days and days and days to mine all of this. You know, three or four hits for every block that you clear. It adds up. I'm wondering why those are... I know that's iron, but why is that... Okay, I guess... I do need a little iron. I want to add a little bit more, a little bit more steel to our to our cage there. Yeah, I've leveled up a lot. I'm sort of ignoring it at the moment. There we go. This little this little be enough materials for like many many horde nights normally I don't do a whole lot of mining on camera but you know if you're worried about the grind in this game you can uh, rest assured that there is to fix that well wow, there's a lot of lead in here Maybe I could sell him some of this stuff, like 3,600, 72, ooh, yeah, I could sell him some, like, sell him a stack of lead, and that would pay for a mining helmet. I think I'll do that. That just means I need more lead, that means. So what's this what is this doing to our game stage? This is this is making our game stage pretty extreme. So don't 
you're if you're using my mod, don't go out and mine everything without a really secure home because you're going to find that the next horde is going to be pretty exponentially harder than the previous one. Oh yeah. Now I'm level 100. Yay. Okay. I gotta make sure there's a way out. Because I hear walkie walkies. Yeah. Look at that. Wandering Horde. What? You didn't die? What that? Anybody else? Okay, didn't think so. Dun, 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 dun. Just in before this guy closes down. What do you want? So I'm gonna sell him. Well, I can probably sell him all. Of, well, I don't want to. No, nah, I, need, I need some. I need some stone. I'm gonna keep the stone. Believe it or not, uh, I'm gonna sell you that. And then, can I take a look at your clothes again? Mining helmet. How about this one? Can I afford this one? I can't afford this one. I will take that, sir. Thank you very much. Thirty-six hundred. Yeah, that lead. That lead fest fetched a good price. Uh, let's see. Books. Does he have any books? Hmm. Weapons mods. Wood splitter. Rod and spring. Increases recoil. Oh, no. Really would like some decent... Yeah, look how... I sold them for seventy two hundred. Look how much it costs to <laughs> oh, to buy back. Yeah, youch. Um, so I could I could buy the rest of this guy's duct tape, can I? It saves me from having to do it. Plus, it gives you a little XP, so you do get some XP from this process. Uh, I don't think I have anything else, you know, high on the need list. Pretty much everything else I can get myself. Four eggs? Sure. Science, mods, cement. Uh, pistol... Yeah, I'm pretty much done. Night vision goggles. Thanks, buddy. Uh, night vision goggles are pretty much pretty worthless. So now that I'm level 100, I may be able, may be able to craft some military boots. That is definitely something that I would like to see. So. Because military boots would allow me to basically explore the entire map and uh, not not have to cut out any travel time, right? Because I, I don't like cutting up videos. Kind of ruins the continuity if videos keep jumping around to, to different things. So I try not to do that. Ooh, hello. No, not... Oh, my God. Wow, 
Oh, a wolf and a doe. And nine more bone. Yay. Okay. Some iron right there. So let's go in, see what we can do. Whoa, for the first time I missed that jump. There we go. Close that behind me. Let's put it in some of this stuff. You, 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 and you, and you. And I've got some raw iron, finally, to put away in here. And some stone. I can uh, craft up another stack of concrete. I've got lots of coal. Nice. Now I'm short on nitrate, believe it or not. Uh, let's put some of these raw clothes away. Oh, I definitely want to wear my mining helmet. Yeah. Oh yeah, we got we got a light now. Beautiful. Uh, and Santa hat, I'm gonna put that in clothes. I don't wanna get rid of that. That's nice. Send a hat. Okay, other things in raw ammo. Oh, we got a good amount of feathers that run. Okay, that's meds, that's food, that's food, that's rotten stuff here, here, and here. I try to sort this out ahead of time. There's some seeds, plant fiber. There's some more raw ammo, and that's why I do it, because I would have missed that I would have missed that thing. Uh, so components is the one chest. Oh no, duct tape. That's that's why I wanted that rotten stuff. Helps to talk out loud too. Right there. Do the plant fiber and seeds and the dirt. And uh, that's that. That's food. I got ourselves a pretty decent amount of meat. And we've got some more dukes. We're slowly building up. I'm sort of going to the the trader is kind of on a whim, so I'm not actually getting a whole lot of stuff out of it. Ah, yes. Now this, you can see, now this is like, for some reason, uh, not nine, seven. There we go. For some reason, it like... Reset. I don't, I don't I don't know why maybe when you leave the area. I think it's when you leave the area and come back in single-player It resets and in multiplayer it resets as soon as you close the window. So That's always an issue um, How much acid do we have? Uh, we have eight acid total uh, And we don't have any plant We don't have any military fibers or anything in there. So let's look at Intellect, Dancing, Hammer and Forge. There's that final one. Uh, da -da, I'm not worried about that. I want a little bit of Nightmare. Oh man, I need it twice as effective. I want it. I want, yeah, might as well. Fortitude. The Huntsman. I want to get that maxed out. Let's get this maxed out. That way I can grab some headshots. One more point. As you can see, the the skills, you know, these the base ones, they get increased in cost as you go down. So it always... It always helps to get those up first because then everything else is just one point. So that's um, narrow down treasure radius, wrenching. Uh, let's add more to loot. I'm anticipating looting a little bit more. And we probably have quite a lot of these. So I don't think I can craft, I think boots Military boots. Yeah, they're 12 military fiber. Uh, military fiber. 
uh, takes an acid, a duct tape, polymers, and plant fibers each. So if we take the acid that we have and the polymers that we have, now I did. Cre I, there is a recipe for acid. I did add this, but it uses things that we don't have. We don't. We don't. We don't have a farm going right now, and I've been throwing all the coffee away. So we go over here. We don't really have much of anything there. We go to food. We don't really have much of anything in here. So unfortunately, we cannot craft much of that. So. Fiber, um, plant fibers, and duct tape. Duct tape and uh, plant fibers. I know I've been keeping those around for, for reasons. Uh, let's go to here. Military fiber. Is it one a piece? I don't know if I changed this recipe or not. Yeah, it's one a piece. So we are literally four fiber short of our own pair of military boots. So I either need to find some more acid and and get on that or find some, you know, SWAT helmet, something I can scrap uh, into military fiber. And then we can craft our own set of boots and then, then it's all bets are off, boy. We'll be able to cruise around the world. No big deal. So we got eight military fiber. That's that's a start. Uh, I can put those in here. Because I really want the boots. Close. Military boots. Twelve fiber. Oh, sad. But that's going to have to do it for this episode. And I thank you for watching. And I will see you next time.